guys the top five reasons to leave your city and move to Raleigh number one cost of living y'all we're in Raleigh we're in the south we are a capital so we are the capital city of North Carolina we're currently downtown but cost of living is so affordable compared to other major cities in the United States for example right now as of November 2020 Raleigh's average rent rent not purchase with rent is $1,250 a month. That is wild. That's insane. We are 63% lower in cost for rent than New York City. So all you New Yorkers, if you're trying to get out of the city, come on down to Raleigh. We've got apartments and we've got the coolest realtor of all time that would love to show you condos, townhomes, houses in case you are in the market to buy. Now, what do we think the cost the average cost of a home in Raleigh was, or is to date for 2020, hmm, nope, nope, it's $375,000. That seems steep, but with interest rates so low right now, on average anywhere from 2.5 to 3.0, your buying power is huge. So the average price being $375,000 is actually quite affordable for first time home buyers. All right guys, reason number two to leave your city and move to Raleigh. We are a big city with a small town feel. I feel like everywhere I go, everybody knows my name. It's like my own cheers. Every coffee shop, every gym, every, well not bars right now because of COVID. I am not going to bars. Every restaurant, I always see someone I know. So we are the capital city, we're a big city, but with a small town feel. Uh, the community is just huge here in Raleigh. We power together, we get things done. And for number three, the third most important reason why you should leave your city and move to Raleigh, we have an amazing foodie scene. We have restaurants galore. They're always popping up everywhere you look around the corner. I'm not playing any favorites because I'm not sponsored yet, but there are amazing restaurants around the Raleigh area. And then even if you want to get adventurous and take the train to Durham, Durham, even though this is a video why you should move to Raleigh, Durham's got a lot of great restaurants as well. Along with that, with the foodie scene, we have amazing coffee shops. I might play favorites here. I do have a favorite coffee shop, and a lot of people are probably gonna hate me for saying this, but whatever, it is what it is. I said what I said. The Starbucks in Cameron Village is my number one spot. All the baristas know my order, my name. It's amazing. It's where I feel at home. But besides Starbucks, I know it's a chain. We have a lot of great community coffee shops as well that also offer amazing little breakfast pastries. So I feel like that kind of goes along with the foodie scene. Food scene, amazing. And for number four, the fourth most important reason why you should leave your city and move to Raleigh. Do you like cocktails? Do you like beer? Do you like to let your hair down and have some fun on the weekends or weeknights? Me too. We've got a lot of breweries, guys. Outdoor breweries, which is crucial right now because of COVID. Everyone is concerned about keeping their distance, staying outside with the open air and we are an amazing space for that. Not only do we have tons of breweries and wine shops that are outdoors with outdoor drinking areas, our temperature, our weather is seasonal and temperate. It's amazing. We can, for the most part, be outdoors drinking any month of the year. I don't really love beer, but for those wine drinkers, most of our breweries have wine options. So it's a win-win. You win some, you lose some, but in my book, it's a win all around. And for our last and final reason, our fifth reason why you should leave your city and move to Raleigh, it's because Raleigh, believe it or not, is full of green spaces. Right now, we're standing in Moore Square, which was just recently completely renovated. Um, tons of green space to walk around, have picnics, bring your kids. Um, sometimes, well, before COVID, we would have like little outdoor farmer's markets on the weekends here. We have Square Burger, which is like a place to eat here. But besides Moore Square, we have Nash Square, we have Fred Fletcher Park, and then we have so many other parks that are hidden in between neighborhoods throughout the city of Raleigh. And then of course, our most famous park is the Umstead Park with 
tons of miles of trails, walking trails, running trails, dog walking trails, hiking trails. It is a treasure. Believe it or not, I went there the other weekend with a friend and our dogs and yet a flat trail. I fell and ate shit. You know, only only Cray would do that. But anyways, Raleigh is you know sneakily hilly with tons of green space. So for all of you big city people who are used to lots of green space in your city as well, Raleigh has it as well, which is also so great during a global pandemic. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. Those are your top five reasons why you should leave your city and move to Raleigh. If you have any questions, concerns, need help finding a place, call your girl Craig. Craig Slays. Bye.